Hello and welcome to the webinar. Our loops are RNA DNA three stranded hybrid loop structure occurring in genomic DNA that are formed during nascent RNA transcription in coding and non coding regions in the genome. Our loops have important biological functions and are clinically linked to cancer, neurological, and cardiovascular diseases. Drip seek is an effective way to profile R loops to discover and understand their functions, mechanisms, and clinical applications in your research. This webinar will cover the emergence of R loops, R loops in cancers, neurological, and cardiovascular diseases, and R loop profiling by Drip seek. The most important R loops in gene regulation are the R loops formed co transcriptionally during gene transcription. Normally, during transcription, the nascent short RNA transcript, about 8 to 10 nucleotides long, is hybridized with its DNA template, but is continuously released from the DNA strand by protein domain in the polymerase and prevented its rehybridization with the DNA. However, under certain circumstances, RNA and double-stranded DNA can form stable R loop by factors such as GC skew, G quadruplex, DNA strain breaks, DNA or RNA modifications, or defects in HIDI cases for the duplex unwinding. RNA in R loop can be resolved and removed enzymatically. However, Defects in endogenous RNS edge activity and perturbation of R loop homeostasis can cause abnormal R loop buildup. For mRNA genes, R loops can form in locations near the transcription start sites (TSS) in the gene body region, or at the transcription termination sites. TTS. R loops occur at much higher frequencies at TSS and TTS, as shown in this characteristic R loop distribution profile along the transcription unit. Overall, R loops are found in 40% of mRNA, 10% link RNA, and 50% of all other non coding RNA genes. So what do R loops do? In functional context, R loops are double-edged sword that can do good or bad things to the cells. R loops have long been considered merely accidental byproducts of transcription as source of genomic instability when not properly removed. That is, R loops may occur unscheduled in the genomic regions, normally free from R loops, either by the lack of R loop removal, for example, by the lack of RNS edge activity, or by the absence of R loop prevention, for example, by the lack of HNRMPs. These unscheduled R loops can cause replication stress, DNA damage, genomic instability, aberrant gene dysregulation, all of which are detrimental. However, it is recently known that there is also a class of regulatory R loops that have an essential role in a variety of biological processes, most importantly in gene regulation and, gene, and genome st stability, which are beneficial. Regulatory R loops may be associated with genomic features that allow them to form readily with increased stability. Such features include G quadruplexes G4, high GG skew, and a favorable chromatin environment. For gene regulation function, R loops at a gene promoter can activate the gene transcription by recruiting transcription factors, activating chromatin modifiers, repel repelling transcription repressors or blocking DNA methylation enzymes. 
at the transcription termination site. R loops can facilitate transcription termination by storing RNA polymerase II, clipping off RNA transcript from its DNA template by recruiting helicases, RNSs, or RNAi silencing machinery. As R loops play many transcriptional and also long transcriptional molecular functions, aberrant R loops are associated with many human diseases, such as cancer, neurological, cardiovascular, immune, stem cell differentiation, regenerative, myelodysplasia, reproductive, and anemic diseases or conditions. We will discuss R loops in cancer, neurological, and cardiovascular diseases in more detail. R loops are prominently involved in cancers. For example, R loops can accumulate in cancer by oncogene activation. Oncogenes such as Ewing sarcoma type 1 or EWS FLIP1 gene, HARAS V12 gene, and estrogen receptor ER can increase local RNA synthesis and greatly promote R loop formation. These R loops can cause DNA replication stress, DNA damage, and genomic instability in cancer. Conversely, R loops can inhibit tumor suppressor genes to cause cancers. For example, NRAS SF1 is a long non coding link RNA anti sense to tumor suppressor RAS SF1 mRNA gene. NRAS SF1 can generate R loops that direct repressive chromatin modifiers PRC2 to the target RAS SF1 mRNA gene promoter. Modified chromatin with repressive H3 K1227 Me3 histone mark cause chromatin condensation and selectively repress the expression of tumor suppressor gene RAS SF1. NRAS SF1 and R loop expression is high in breast cancer and prostate cancer cells compared with lung tumor cells. R loop regulation of DNA methylation is another way of R loop involvement in cancer. R loops are enriched at the genomic loci with decreased DNA methylation, increased DNA hypersensitivity and higher chromatin accessibility. In fact, R loop accumulation is one of the characteristic features of a methylated CPG island containing promoters. Here, link RNA tarot forms an R loop at a tumor suppressor TCF21 mRNA gene promoter. As an R loop reader, GAT45A protein binds directly to the R loop recruits TT1 DNA demethylase and demethylates the local DNA. The demethylated promoter becomes active in the expression of TCF21 tumor suppressor. R loops can recruit transcription factors to promote target gene transcription. For example, VIN AES1 is an antisense link RNA to VIN gene. Link RNA VIN AS1 can form R loop in the VIN gene promoter region, recruiting transcription factor NF kappa B to promote VIN mRNA expression. In actual, in acute myeloid leukemia (ML), the highly expressed hot tip link RNA forms R loop to localize enhancer insulator CTCF an enhancer protein cohesion at, about, at the boundaries of topologically associating domain, TAD, at the wing beta catenin gene locus. TAD facilitates the inter interactions between cis regulatory elements and its target promoter to ensure enhanced interaction and robust target gene expression. Here, the R loops promotes TAD formation enhancer to promoter interaction and 
beta catalin transcriptional activation leading to leukemic transformation. Without the hard tip R loops, the tail is lost, which mitigates leukemia. Telomere maintenance is required in cancer cell proliferation. Alternative telomere lengthening, or ALT, is a way of keeping telomere length in cancer cells without depending on telomerase activity. In ALT positive, telomerase negative aggressive neuroblastoma, Ninka and Terra expressed in telomeres is heavily M6 modified. The M6 modified Ninka and Terra can form R loops, which is required for telomere lengthening. Drug inhibition of M6A writer protein, metal 3, blocks Terra methylation, suppresses R loop formation, causing telomere damage and reduce cancer cell variability. Thus, M6A writer inhibitor could be a new neuroblastoma treatment strategy while Terra R loop. The parent R loop and cancer progression has been studied in lung adenocarcinoma, LUAD. Here, R loop score is computed by using the expression profiles of R loop regulator genes. Malignant cancer cells from 30 cancer samples can be clustered into 27 subtypes on UMAP plot. The R loop scores are distinctively and inversely associated with clinical tumor stages. That is, the lower R loop scores are associated with more advanced cancer cell types. T cell killing our cancer cells is the basis of cancer immunotherapy. Low R loop scores are correlated with the cancer cell escaping from immune response. Whereas tumor associated antigen, TAA and MHC required for T cell killing are downregulated, the tumor associated immunosuppressive factors are upregulated. In the figure on the right, High R loop scores are more responsive to anti PDF1, PDF1 cancer immunotherapy in patients. In lung adenocarcinoma cancer, treatment by tyrosine kinase inhibitor TK, TKI, patients with higher R loop scores were more responsive to the treatment as shown on the left and had a significantly better survival than low R loop scores, as shown on the right. Therefore, R loop score is a strong predictor of TKI therapy efficacy. In gene cell enrichment analysis of pathways, the inflammatory response pathways and immune-related pathways are clearly enriched in the drug-responsive samples with high R loop scores, whereas metabolic pathways are significantly enriched in drug resistance samples with low R loop scores. In further gene set variation, GSVA analysis, the energy metabolic pathways responsible for tumor progressions are significantly enriched in low R loop score samples. The link between R loop scores and the metabolism possibly explains the drug metabolism and drug tolerance in cancer cells. Clinically, low R loop score is correlated with higher all-time risk of mortality, as shown on the left. R loop score correlates with prognosis and therapeutic respons responses in the overall survival probability, according to R loop score in, ther in therapy in chemotherapy treated cancer patients, as shown on the right. FANCI FANCI is an R loop regulator which is upper regulated in almost all cancer types in the Cancer Genome Atlas TCGA. Its high expression correlates with poor cancer prognosis. 
genome-wide R loops were profiled by DRIP-seq and R loop signals along the gene lens are plotted here. Fancy lockdown causes large loss of R loops. The R loop changes are significantly enriched in cancer progression associated pathways such as RAS and MAP kinase signaling pathways. So far, we have seen many examples of R loops in cancers. R loops are also involved in many other diseases, including neurological diseases. Amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, ALS4, is a neurodegenerative disease. In normal healthy people, nascent transcriptions of BAMB mRNA induces R loop formation which blocks DNA methylation and upregulate BAMB mRNA transcription in a positive feedback manner. That is, in the more BAMB mRNA transcription, the more R loop. The more R loops, the more BAMB transcription. In this study alone, more than a thousand other genes are regulated by R loops this way. In amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, LS4, synataxin helicase is mutated, which reduces R loop and BAMB expression. BAMB is a TGF beta inhibitor. Decrease the BAMB causes overactive TGF beta pathway in LS4 cells. Fragile X syndrome, FXS, is an X-linked neurodevelopmental disorder, which is caused by expansion of hypermethylated CGG trinuclear repeats at the 5' UTR that silences FMR1 gene. By treating the FXS, patient cells with MEK and BRAF kinase inhibitors, the, G, the CGG repeats are demethylated to allow reactivation of FMR1 transcription and the co-transcriptional R loop formation. The R loops are necessary and sufficient to cause the long CGG repeats to contract by recruiting endogenous DNA repair mechanisms that then drives the repeat excision. This process is positive feedback and has very strong effect. Thus, the R, loop, the R loops mediates CGG repeat shortening and reactivations of FMR1 gene can be a therapeutic approach for the neurodevelopmental disorder. R loops are also involved in cardiovascular diseases. For example, synataxin associated exonucleus SAM1 is a helicase that resolves R loops. Its deficiency, such as SAM1 lockout, can cause excessive R loop accumulation. Excessive R loops are accompanied with increased DNA damage, impaired cardiomyocyte proliferation, small heart cell numbers, cardiomyocyte hypertrophy, and heart diseases. To study R loops in your biological system, R loop profiling is an essential step. Drip seek is an effective technology for the task. In Drip seek, about 10 micrograms of genomic DNA is used. The genomic DNA containing R loops is fragmented and immunoprecipitated by RNA DNA hybrid specific antibody. S9.6 that binds to R loops. The fragments in R loops are sequenced by sequencing and analyzed, by, and analyzed for R loop peak signals. The R loop peaks from drip seek are annotated for their genomic locations, R loop peak directions, GC skew values the source gene for the R loop RNA, whether the R loop RNA is coding mRNA or long coding link RNA, and peak classification in gene features such as promoter, 
terminator gene body uh, in the genetic regions unlock distribution and unlock enrichment in gene features and transcription units are plotted The GIPC track provides visualizations of R loop peaks across the genome for differentially expressed R loops in the mRNA genes. Gene oncological functions analysis and pathway analysis are performed to observe what biological functions or pathways are impacted by these R loops. R loop profiling by GIPSeq can generate a wealth of information. As a research roadmap ahead, the top differentially expressed R loops can be confirmed by GIPS qPCR and up an R loop associated target gene expression by mRNA or link RNA qPCR. To confirm R loops, the confirmed R loops can be further studied by media sequencing to investigate if the R loops changes DNA methylation. Chromatine changes or transcription factor binding by ChIP-seq or pull-down analysis. Finally, link RNA and mRNA microarray can be used to measure the outcomes of target gene expression under the R-loop regulation. All these can provide an integrated view of R-loop regulatory effects. I hope the information so far is helpful for your R research. Thank you for your interest. Please visit us at arrays.com.